Hey guys, Dr. Jen here with another chiropractic analogy for you. I have a reminder set on my phone and every single month it pings me to check my home air filter. I check my air filter and if it's dirty, I replace it. Now I know that some people let theirs go a whole lot longer than a month and by the time you get to it that thing is like steel gray, sometimes black and it's not working like it's supposed to. So now you're breathing in this dirty, disgusting air. The best thing to do is to check it on a regular basis. Make sure that that filter is clear and free from all that dust and debris so that the air that you're breathing is nice and pure. Same thing is true of your body. Just like that air filter collects a lot of dust over the month, your body on a daily basis encounters a lot of stressors and those stressors build up on your system. And if your body's not able to adapt to them, what can happen is a vertebral subluxation. A tiny misalignment in your spine that cuts off the communication between your brain and your body. Basically, it's essentially like having a dirty air filter. Things just aren't going to work like they're supposed to. You're not going to have the strongest, healthiest body possible when you have a spine that is subluxated. Having your spine checked on at least a once per week basis is like checking that air filter every month. All right, if that air filter is dirty, replace it. If your spine is subluxated, you should be adjusted. It's gonna make sure that the rest of your body is able to function like it's supposed to. So if you're not seeing a chiropractor on at least a once per week basis, I highly, highly encourage you to do so. It makes all the difference. Thank you so much for watching. I'll catch you guys in the next video.